Come on in, come on in, come on in. It's Thomas. I don't have no ribbon, so don't worry about it. It's all good. We're here with the lovely Cara. Hey guys. And today's topic is we're going to share um, a favorite uh, memory of a Christmas party. So, Cara, you want to go ahead first? Sure, I'll start. So, my job would have holiday parties. They wouldn't call them Christmas parties, but they would call them holiday parties. So, my department, well, a couple group of, you know, just uh, co-workers that I would be cool with, we would have a, our own Christmas party in a certain division within our office. So, everybody would bring it uh, pot potluck style. Pretty much everyone would bring their favorite dish. Um, we had, like, someone bring their own favorite desserts and have, like, a, a contest of who made the favorite desserts. So that part was fun. We would have our own holiday music playing in the background. Uh, this was doing uh, office work, so we would kind of make up excuses as to, you know, what was really going on because we didn't want certain people coming to the party. So that part was kind of tricky to do, but that is a fun memory that I do remember, which was really fun for us to do. Because I think that was like my last year of me working there at that office or at that building at that time. So it was pretty much, pretty much that. It was fun. Cool, cool. So, I mean, was it any, like, certain people that y'all was like, no, we're not just going to eat that food? Well, these people we were all cool with. So, we all, like, would go to lunch together. Mm -hmm. So, we kind of knew that they were, they were cool. Like, if you, you know, would go over their house or something like that, then it was no problem for okay. what they cooked for. We want like, the potato salad. I don't really eat anybody's potato salad except for my mother's. So, but someone did make potato salad, and I did try it. It was it was okay, but it wasn't close to my mom, so yeah, I did try that. Mm -hmm. All right, cause you know how like sometimes you be like, oh, they got cats. Yeah, you see cats. stuff remnants yeah. on the on the mm -mm, like cause, anything like that. Uh, my mom, at, where she would work at, they would do the holiday parties, and people would bring stuff in. It would be this one certain lady, nobody would eat the, um, the whatever food. she made. Yeah. Oh. Because, I mean, you know, when you work with people for a long time, mm -hmm. like years, you see how the habits that they do right. when they're working, you'd be like, oh, no, that's not cool. I know, but, yeah, but they, I guess these group of people, the ones that we had our own special Christmas, these people I considered, you know, like family. Okay. So that made it even that's cool. better. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. And especially you've been to their homes and stuff mm -hmm. and saw how they do things. Right. But you're right. You can't eat everybody's. Like, people have pets and dogs and mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. see the way they dress. They have stains all on their clothes. Like. <laughs> I don't want to eat that one. And, <laughs> and how they do their work. Right. Like, oh, shit. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Like, I'll skip this one. Yeah. But, yeah. And just like um, in the video that I, I just, sh well, it'll be coming up if it have not been shared already. With cupcakes. And I was, um. Oh, yes, yes, you can have some cupcakes. Um, I was explain explaining how um, I went over this girl house and, um. Uh, she wasn't really a friend. Mm -hmm. You know how you just have people because they're in the neighborhood, you play with them. Right. And so <laughs> you go, you know, in the house or whatever. And she was making Kool-Aid. And so um, she was like, you want some? It was a big pitcher of Kool-Aid. But then when I saw her tasting it mm -hmm. and they put that spoon right back in the Kool-Aid and started, I was like, oh, no, that's okay. Oh, yeah, that's only for family. Like, you can't offer that to anybody outside of the family. Yeah, and sometimes not even family. family right, mm-mm. <laughs> I, I will say I used to do that, making Kool-Aid back in, it was, it's been so, so long ago since I made some Kool-Aid. But I would do that, like, I would get my... Uh, all my utensils all set up, the Kool-Aid, the packet, the sugar, my big ass spoon, oh, my big spoon, I should say that, my big spoon, stir it up, mix it up, slip on it, sip, 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 oh, need more sugar, pour more sugar in, stir, 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 sip again, put the spoon back in the Kool-Aid, and put it in the refrigerator. Yeah, then my family would drink it, so. Yeah, but you said I'm a family. corporate family, yes. yes. <laughs> family, but it... All I'm just saying, these days, you can't be doing that. Mm -mm. Like, and I even mentioned that, you know, they might got that herpes on them lips and stuff. A lot of people be having them cold, cold sores and, and mm -hmm. herpes. And, and then they rub it on that and dip it dip back it in. And then you be like, oh! Can't do that. Mm -mm. There's so much more things now these days. So, yeah, gotta be cautious. Right. Mm -hmm. So, I always rinse it off and, like, bullshit and put it back put in. Put it back in. We'll right. Yeah. Cause I was like, yeah, okay. Not me. Mm -mm. <laughs> That's Kool Aid for you. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all can rest the show when y'all eat my food. <laughs> Kisha ain't double dip. <laughs> like, oh, you know how they be like, don't double, don't double dip, dip, dip the, yeah, chip. the chips. <laughs> People do that. 
do still do that. You better get your own little dish. Dip right. <laughs> Ration it that way. I was like, you don't know what they was doing, whipping with that man or something, and then gonna be, you know, no brush his teeth. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> or that woman, and then be like, oh, yeah. Okay, let's put it back in there. Mm mm. Then sharing it with you, everybody yeah. else. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, <laughs> so, um,. I have a few um, memories um, for his Christmas parties as being with the family. Um, before my grandmother died, on Christmas Eve, the family would go to her home and um, we would sing Christmas carols, um, drink eggnog and things like that. And that was like a um, fun time for me. Um, and exchange gifts. So that that was awesome. And then like grandma would always give us the... Um, the butter cookies and the two dollar one bill. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Cause she had a lot of grandchildren, um, like ten of them. Cause I was the tenth one, and then um, later oh, on, the yeah. Then later on, um, I think about four more came. Antoinette, yeah, about four more came. But um, a lot of them were still young when she passed, so. But yeah, that's what grandma would do for us. So she had a lot of grandchildren, so she didn't have like a whole lot to be. But then she had her 10 children. Yeah, because the other children came and messed up because it was 10 children, 10 grandchildren. You know, I made it complete. And then <laughs> somebody else came along. Yeah, and then my cousin came. We always go through this, but we, it's mad love. It's mad love. <laughs> that's too funny. We always be having a cousin, Valerie, whatever. Valerie, yeah, whatever. Alright, so anyway, um, Christmas party. So this was um, the time when I worked for a company called Event Network. And so they had a gift shop in um, the aquarium and Port Discovery. So I will always work at the Port Discovery. It was almost like me owning my own little store over there. <laughs> Didn't have to be with the rest of the people. Mm -hmm. So, okay. yeah. And so they <laughs> They had a Christmas party and it was at one of the um Christmas mm, I'm gonna say Christmas museum. I think it was the art art museum. And that Christmas party was so much fun because we had like raffle tickets, we was winning stuff mm -hmm. and it was just so much fun. I was like that was like one of the best like office whatever work Christmas parties. I was just like yes, yes, yes. And then the Christmas parties that I would do myself. I think the one that um Benny House was um, the most memorable one when um, you, Quais, everybody was there. Mm -hmm. Trina, Tyler, yeah, it was like Tyler, mm -hmm. um, Adrian, like everybody. And then we had so fun when we went to Alicia's house, and mm -hmm. then we did John's. Right? Why well, didn't go to John's? <laughs> it, it was nice, but it was kind of. Uh, He's watching. <laughs> No, 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 it wasn't so much him, but it was like some people there oh. that kind of made it a little Too tight. Nice. No, like tight, like, oh, like, I don't know what the word is. It's loud. No, no, no. It, was just, it was just mean. The person was mean. Oh. So, <laughs> That's not good for Christmas. Right, right, right. <laughs> And then Jonathan, we know you watching, but yeah, you you was just like in the back with your own friend, and um, we needed you to be out there with your guests. But um, I like <laughs> protecting your eye. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> well, anyway, so the one that was at Benny House <laughs> it was fun because it was like nobody was uptight. Me and Benny was a part of the group. Only thing was sad but was like his uh, ex-girlfriend had just lost her grandfather. But y'all didn't realize that because he had got himself together. By the time when he came back out, he was like good. Aww. So that was the only thing that happened. But like the food was on point. Mm -hmm. We had a great time. We had games. We did the karaoke. Like we had we had a good time. Um, but yeah. Um, and then I like how we would do the different um, menus. So like, one we did like soul food. Mm -hmm. The other one we did, um, I think Jonathan House we did like Chinese. Okay. Yeah, he had the um, 
fortune cookies and mm -hmm. I think the boxes. It was, it was nice. Um, yeah, so pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. But yeah, so those was the um, the Christmas parties and um, great memories. But yeah. <laughs> Oh guys, I probably will be on the uh, on the list for sharing about that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um, the people there they they, they know who who was me, and uh, yeah. Um, it wasn't Jonathan. It was not Jonathan, but it, it was it was the guest involved, mm -hmm. and we was like, okay, <laughs> goodness. <laughs> All right, yo. <laughs> you can explain your um, Christmas party, church party. Oh, we had yeah. I would go to some of the church Christmas parties, but they kind of like big. I don't really remember them too much. Mm -hmm. mm, I don't know why, but um, they they were some good ones, I guess. What I can remember. But anyway, those the ones that I said are ones that I remember the most, and yeah all right so write your stuff down in the description box as always thank you for tuning in to come bling with me let your light shine in every aspect of your life until next time shine and bling on